You're watching Talk with Audrey. Welcome back. Medicare Open Enrollment started October 15th and runs through December 7th. It's that time of the year when more than 64 million people with Medicare can review their health care and prescription drug coverage and make changes. Joining me today with everything we need to know about Medicare Open Enrollment, Dr. Mina Seishamani, Director, Center for Medicare for the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you so much for having me, Audrey. Well, this is a great time. A lot of changes this year. Uh, talk to us first, if you would, about why this open enrollment period is important for people with Medicare. Well, coverage options change every year. Even your current choice may be changing. And health needs also change and personal budgets. And so by comparing all of your options, you could save money, find better coverage, or both. And so people with Medicare should review their coverage during this open enrollment period to see if there are better options based on changes to the current plan, to personal budget, or health needs. And who's eligible to participate in Medicare open enrollment? Open enrollment is for all people with Medicare, which is health insurance for people age 65 and older, those with disabilities, or people with end-stage renal disease. And how will the Inflation Reduction Act help people save money with Medicare? Well, good news. Thanks to the Inflation Reduction Act, starting January 1st, 2023, plans cannot charge more than $35 for a month supply of each Part D covered insulin. And they can't charge a deductible for that either. So that means savings for people. And that's something to keep in mind when looking for a prescription drug plan. That's wonderful. And it'll be such sweet music to so many people who've been waiting for that. Um, when it comes to comparing Medicare plans, how can people compare their current plan with perhaps a new plan that they've heard about? Yeah, people can go to medicare.gov, click on find plans now, and then in Plan Finder, they can put in the prescription drugs they're taking and get side-by-side -side comparisons of plans based on coverage, cost, and quality ratings so that they can make a decision that they can feel confident with. All right, so open enrollment ends on December 7th. What happens if people miss that deadline? Well, after December 7th, people with Medicare will have to wait until the next open enrollment period to be able to compare coverage options and choose the best fit for them. And that's why we strongly encourage people with Medicare to review their coverage now, because even if you're happy with your current coverage, you may find a better fit. And one more time, if you would, Dr. Seishamani, where can people get help when comparing plans and where can they go to compare plans? Yeah, so we have medicare.gov and if you need additional help call us at 1-800-MEDICARE we are here 24 hours a day seven days a week to help you to to figure out what plan works best for you there's also free personalized health insurance counseling in your local community through the state health insurance assistance program or ship so you can visit shiphelp.org for locations near you and for people who might have difficulty paying for Medicare, is there help available? Yes, for people of limited income and resources, you could qualify for the Medicare savings programs, which help save money on health and prescription drug costs. To find out more, you can call your state's Medicaid office or call us at 1-800-MEDICARE and ask about the Medicare savings programs. So a lot of new things this year, guys, lower cost for insulin. And I understand also that there are some vaccines that are now covered. That's correct. So for recommended vaccines, including the shingles vaccine, starting January 1st, 2023, people with Medicare will be able to get those vaccines at no cost to them out of their pocket, thanks to the Inflation Reduction Act. That's really wonderful. Where can we go in general? For more information and if you'd give us the website and phone number again please yes so medicare.gov is the website with the plan finder 1-800 medicare is the phone number to call to get additional help 24 hours a day seven days a week and shiphelp.org is the website to find a location for free 
personalized health insurance counseling in your community. All right, everyone. Woo, Medicare open enrollment is from October 15th through December 7th. If you miss that December 7th deadline, you have to wait until next year. So got some research to do. You could save some money. Uh, you can also find out all about the new insulin benefits, the vaccines, everything you need to know by going to medicare.gov or calling 1-800-MEDICARE. Dr. Mina Seishamani, Director, Center for Medicare for the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, has been my guest. Again, thank you so very much for your time today. Thank you again, Audrey, and thank you for getting the word out. My absolute pleasure.